So with some great news I can happily announce as well that Shonen Jump has on their like actual web title with the digital license that has actually got and added the series Promise Netherland onto there which is very exciting and all that since this series has definitely grown up in a lot of popularity in the free chances. It's very shocking to see like especially like I believe Academia and Clover didn't get this treatment when they first came out on their Jump Start system where they would have to wait a little while to get recommendations on that but no a lot of people really really loved what we first saw on the Promise Netherland land immediately on there so I'm happy to say that with that and all that pretty much have the worries and all that to actually continue doing this series now and all that like uh really happy about that and you should be getting new reviews every Monday from now on let's just hope and all that like we can get this with some of the other brand new stuff and all that that's already out now I've got to say we're immediately coming into the chapter and all that like we can see and all that with Emma and all that like we was able to find that there was some tablecloths so that pretty much you got to their ro uh, rope and all that however they've, they've been like I think it's okay to tell Ray about this and like Ray is the kind of person that wouldn't exactly panic in the scenario and he's pretty much kind of gathered up and all that and like you guys already like being like kind of very dodging around you've been very lurky around and it's like you know what's going on and pretty much explains it and all that and like I kind of appreciate like, like the mentality and like what he had was like you guys are kidding right and all that it's like you know not on the whole part of like yeah the demons and all that and the monsters but it's more like Let's think about this and all that with the, with the you know mom and the demons and the tracking devices and all that and you want to save everyone That's just we can't Emma. That's near eye impossible and all that like actually doing that and it's like Thinking about it and all that, it's like, it's an outside, it's a demon's world, controlled by demons and all that. Worst case scenario and all that, there is no place for humans to live. Like, we, what all the humans could possibly be, like, enslaved and all that. We don't know if there are actual people out there still fighting the fight. And even when he was like, the last book that I've got of the recent age and all that is 2015. Which is interesting is that it was 2015 when everything went into shit and all that which I, I found which was absolutely hilarious it's like so literally one year so much between like 2015 and 2016 is when things went up to shit like with the whole demons and things so that's very interesting and, all that, and I hope we find that at least out like sometimes in the series and all that what exactly went down in that time and all that like going in since it's now like it was very interesting that this series is 30 years in the future like this takes place in like uh, like 2045 like I really find that like interesting and all that like they're going into that and it's like you know We want to change the world and all that you know if there's like you know And like Emma is very kind of naive and all that saying you know I want Connie to be the last person and all that to ever die in that scenario And so you know if there's no place for humans to live and all that then let's make one outside and all that We just got like we made sure now that you know you're ready you got to stay from this and all that you know and one thing is that Norman knew this and all that like from the start and he's definitely very smart about it and it's just like he's saying like look I, I like I love Emma and all that and she was scared of like like losing her family and, all that. and it's like I care about her and all that and it's like I like Emma and that's why I always want to be to see her smile and it's like you know I'll do anything and all that he's saying you know like you know to accomplish that and he's saying like Ray's like why she dies though and he's like I'll use myself to accomplish it I won't let that happen it's like it's definitely shows that immediately that like you know really cares about Emma like a lot and he's like I'm definitely going to make sure that this never happens at all and all that and it's just like you know regardless of what they if you can bake mud and all that it can become a vessel and all that we can make a boat made out of mud and all that it's just you know we can do anything pretty much and all that you know and, and it, I just I like the moment where it's like what are you going to do Emma and I and saved all that we've completely lost it and it's like and you know you can't let us go on our own however though although like the mom is like the most interesting part in the series we didn't actually get to see her a lot in this chapter apart from that she is using her tracking device and she was able to know that they three of them were all there like so she probably has a good idea that, that it's them and now that you know Ray's being involved and all that that she definitely has an eye on them so I don't know it's like especially with like last week's chapter and all that that was the one I had the most interest in like with like finding out more about her story than the actual main character so far so I'm very like you're seeing that where exactly this is now all going to go from this chapter but definitely I did like chapter 4 a lot I definitely did like think this is a good side start and still the series is building up a lot of mystery and it's definitely a lot of planning for already like uh, already 4 chapters in a month like into chapters and all that I definitely look forward to seeing that how everything's going to be executed now at the start of the series. So definitely going to have to wait and see and all that where the series is definitely going to be going and all that in the future. But really enjoyed the chapter. Definitely think I'm going to give this one a 7.5 out of 10. I think it's like, I still think it's the weakest chapter that we've had so far in the series. But definitely is very building up everything to go on. Later. But Jerry, I want to know more about the Mark. Like, I want to know more about her. What's her story and all that. Like, she's brand new and all that. What did she exactly do? But that's all for me though. So thank you much for watching as always. And I will catch you guys though next time.